What is going on guys? Today we're going to be doing the review of Team of the Year Frankie de Jong. We've managed to get him in a draft and if you can see him down below as well we have got Conte that potentially we will do a review on him as well in this video. Um, I know he is a bench player or so. We, we may do a review on him later on. Um, I'll see what happens in this kind of draft anyway. Um, it's the first time I've got two of these. I've never done any of these two players, uh, but De Jong's first up. He's got a cheeky little hunter on him, and we will be bringing him into um, that center mid role. I don't think, can he get 10 there? Oh, he can get 10 there. So that's where I'm going to be playing him. Um, he looks sensational. I honestly love De Jong in the team and hopefully one day we will pick him up and put him into the God squad um, as he would link with Messi perfectly. Overall stats look sensational as every team of the year. Hunter is absolutely perfect for him as well. Literally the complete midfielder you can possibly get in the game so far. Absolutely mad. If he had a four star, four star, this card would, card would be worth three to four mil. I'm, I'm picking numbers out of a hat. He's 1.6 mil at the moment. Personally, they've only just came out of packs, so I can imagine they probably will go up a little bit and then more than likely it will fall down a bit. He is more defensive minded, but with a hunter on him, I am going all out attack for him. His stats are just stupidly good. Everything is high rated. There's nothing really that I can say is bad about this card. Everything looks fantastic. Everything is above like 85 from what I can see. Bar from them, couple of uh, yellows right there. They're really nothing. Penalties and free kicks. I don't care. You're not having them anyway. So it's going to be a very, very good draft with him. So going into the first match, we are coming up against a BPL. We've got Trent as a centre-back. We've got Pogba, Figo, Son, Mane, Wijnaldum, Eriksen, Team of the Year, Robbo, who will be being done soon, so stay tuned for that. And then we've got mid Schmeichel and net. Let's see what our men can do. We see him. He's running forward. We're going to go for a few step-overs. Defender's not going to be able to stop him. Oh, look at it. Oh, how has he not scored that? But look at that play already. Lovely from De Jong right now. Oi, go on. De Jong, go, De Jong, carry on with the run. Carry on with the run. Love it. That is fantastic work from him. And that's exactly what I was hoping he was going to be able to do. Martial not managing to get the pass off there. We see Martial. We get the finesse. It's a beautiful goal. Very well build up play. Kante being heavily involved. De Jong doing very good work. Overall, very happy with it already. Um, both of them are, are nuts. I do want them both in the team. Um, I feel like both of them are going to be insane players in their both aspects. I feel like Kante, CDM role, definitely has got it down to an absolute T. And then obviously, De Jong is going to just be that... He is a defensive mid, and I played him as a defensive mid in his normal card. But I feel because of his stats now, he's going to be pretty much any position you want. Want Managing to get that goal as well. We're 2-0 up now. De Jong was looking for it as well there. That was uh, really nice to see. Salah winning it again. Oh, no, he's, I've let him through again. Two two out of two. He's, he's back. He's back in this after 2-0 up. Wow, that's lapsy-daisy defending from me. De Jong's running through. Way. De Jong is very, very quick in this. The Hunter does work for him. Conte cleaning up bits. Over to De Jong. Into Martial's feet. De Jong, can we, can we outrun Virgil? It it. Big header as well. Maybe not. Good play already though. I like it. Managing to, to kind of leave Virgil in his absolute dirt. Right, we need to change the centre-back straight away because he has made so many mistakes there and I completely forgot to change him, but when we went 2-0 up, I felt comfortable. Now, Koulibaly is coming on. We're going to beat him. There's no way we're losing this because the guy just runs. That's all he does. There we go. Frankie, Frankie, De Jong. First goal for me. I know it's a little bit of a sweat goal, but still manages to get the goal. That's what I like to see. And I just love seeing that team of the year on the bottom there. There we go, Conte. Go on, take a bit of a run again. There we go. Open space for him. Two minutes. Go on. 
Love it. Get through. Pass it across. Oh, Conte. D literally, these guys are cheat codes. Honestly, if you've got a full team of the year, BPL team of the year, I don't even want to know what De Bruyne's like as an actual cam as well because these guys are technically DMs or box-to-box -box midfielders. That That's nuts that these guys can do this already. And there's another goal. And he is gone. First game done, 5-3. Couldn't wait to leave. Obviously, turn the control, uh, console off uh, or dashboarded by the very least there. Lovely work. I knew I was going to win the match. De Jong, on the other hand, at box-to-box -box mid. Again, very, very happy with him. He's running up and down the line like no other. No other. Managing to get assists, goals, ass uh, more assists, everything. He is just wonderful. And with that Hunter Kem style on as well, so, so goddamn quick. So going into the second match of this, we are coming up against team of the year, Trent. We got Burkham on the left forward role. Ibra, Dembele, Kante, Goretzka. I've not seen that Goretzka in time. Laporte on Titi and then to stay in the net with Alba and Overmars as a left mid. Why is he not put Overmars as the left forward? And I don't, I don't get that. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what he does. Young making that run forward. Can he be stopped? Just makes that tackle on T. I was hoping that we could, if we could get like a little chip or like a ground, like a little chipped pass, that would be absolutely marvelous to get a ball over the top there. Just a little dink there to that striker would have been nice. De Jong, get the finesse. Oi, oh, he's going for that shot. Oh, I wanted to get the head on that. De Jong. Oh, is it the post? Oh, no. Where's the patch when you need it? De Jong. Honestly, De Jong uh, uh, is just unreal. Defensively, is so, so goddamn solid. It's nice. De Jong. Playing more of a left mid in this role. I don't get why he's, he's a cam, but I suppose I don't really care if he's if he's managing to do it all on his own. Half-time, feeling very, very confident in this match as well. Everyone's doing what they should do. Um, Conte's obviously got the goal. De Jong's doing work. Martial's doing work. Zidane's playing it like none other. De Jong. Oh my god, On it, honestly, these centre mids, I need them in my team, wow, great ball, great but finish. Conte again, just stop it, wow, fantastic, he's even gone, he's even gone, Th this is just nuts, so, so nuts from them both. So going into the overall review for Frankie De Jong, and what can I say? Honestly, a DM, CM, Cam, same same as uh, Conte really. Conte had more of a defensive element to him, um, like he would, but even so, De Jong played the Cam that seemed to be like a left mid for some reason, but again, was quick, was fast, was strong, defend. It, honestly, you've got to pick him up for 1.45 mil, he is well worth getting. He will probably be my next purchase once I get the coins for him because honestly was phenomenal, was absolutely phenomenal. Um, and he'll be definitely uh, linking up with Messi, Zidane, it just incredible player from him. I really, really did enjoy him and think he's well worth the investment if you can get the coins together. Um, personally, it's going to take a little bit of a grind, but I feel like we can get the 1.4 mil at some point. And then obviously we will be looking to get Conte as well, uh, which is a little bit more of a grind. It's 2.6. So we'll have to figure out how we're going to get that. Uh, we'll probably have to pack someone absolutely massive to 
to be able to afford that. But 10 out of 10 for Frankie as well. Um, I gave 10 to uh, to Conte as well. If you didn't see the video, I believe Conte will be going out first or at least will be now. Uh, but apart from that, hopefully you enjoyed. We're nearly finished all the team of the year. So stay tuned for the final couple and I'll see you all for the next one. Peace. Like and subscribe.